So I had some people asking me about this thing. There's really not much to it. Uh, it's more of a mobile test stand than it is something where you actually work on the engine and assemble it. Although I did make the mounting for the uh, the engine far enough away from this center post here that you can actually pull the shroud off, which I did. On this engine, it was sitting in a barn forever, and it had a bunch of mouse nests under the blower shroud. So, uh, yeah, it's it's meant to be able to have some of the tins taken off so you can do a little bit of diagnosis and fixing while it's on there. Primarily, this is uh, for testing rebuilt engines before they get assembled uh, or installed into the, into the tractors. It's just a lot easier to work on this way. Um, so what it is, is a mix of a bunch of different things. There's the lower frame section here is from, I think, an old pressure washer frame, which I cut up into pieces. That front part was a handle. And then took other pieces there, welded them on for swivel feet in the front. Here you can see, yeah, tiny little swivel feet. Uh, then the rest of the frame is more old pressure washer stuff. Uh, I went ahead and wired everything up so that basically you can just plug in a K-series Kohler uh, that runs off a of battery ignition. And... Uh, you hook up the starter, hook up the voltage regulator and the coil, and uh, it's got a battery on the back here, and the solenoid and everything, and a tiny little gas tank from uh, one of those tillers over there. So it's a mix of a bunch of different things, and uh, I wanted to test this engine before I put it in anything, and this is what I came up with. So. Right now I'm checking the charging circuit. What I've got is uh, a bad key switch. It's an old key switch out of one of the other one of the other IH cubs. And uh, this terminal here is really, really loose. It's like super loose inside the contacts and everything. So anyway, uh, I was trying to see if I could fix it. It was actually starting to burn the plug out. Like it was melting that plug. So let's see if it'll... That's pretty much it. Charging for now. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what it was. It's hideous, so you can't really tell just by looking at it. But yeah, it, it does the job. I've got over here, I've got a couple K-series K I'm going to rebuild. Uh, there's, and they're all 12 horse. Uh, AQS models, so they have the uh, gear-driven starter instead of the starter generator, and an integral voltage regulator, and a couple other things that make them a little different than the ones that came before them, but I've got two blocks there, and there's a third one somewhere else. Uh, plan on rebuilding them all because they're sweet engines, and they're not going to have parts out there for them forever, so... My plan is to have a couple sitting around that are ready to go in whatever project they need to go in. So, there it is.